Hi everyone. So I am back to do a one month post-op review on my start surgery and I am so happy to say that it's been a month already. I'm like, wow, where did the time go? It really does go by so fast and I cannot believe it's a month already. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. But um, so what to share with you guys? One month post. I pretty much kind of gave you everything in my last video there. But um, the, remember I was telling you guys about how it was very sore on my top um, left molar on the very back one. That has definitely subsided now. I'm not feeling any pain. Well, a little bit like I press on it, but it is fun. And I'm so happy about that because I didn't want to have to like go and see a dentist or a, my ortho and you know, something bad happening. But yeah, everything's good and I'm so happy. Um, so I stopped turning my expander on Tuesday, or I stopped turning my expander on Saturday, so I haven't been turning it for abruptly three days, and my teeth, my gap is pretty darn really big right now. So they told me that, you know, Saturday was the last day to turn this thing. And by turning, I have like, oh, I wish I had my key with me. I ran upstairs so I can show you guys what um, the key looks like. Because I mentioned it, mentioned it a lot in the video. And so if you are going to be getting an expander or are doing a start surgery, they will definitely give you one of these. So this is what it looks like. It's got a little metal thing on the, the tip here. Perfect. And when I first got this, and the first day I had to crank my expander, I was so, so scared. I was like, I don't want it to feel, I don't want to have that weird feeling. And I was worried about pain. People said that there was no pain, but I, you know, you always worry about the unknown. And that's what I was doing. And so it freaking took me a while to figure out how to actually put it in properly. And I Googled some video, or YouTube some videos, and those were very, very helpful. Um, so anyways, I pretty much, I can't do it now because I'm not able to allow to turn anymore. Your key, as they call it, and mm, I'm going to clip a little hole in there. Okay, now I'm freaking out that I'm going to push it back. Okay, let's just improvise. So there's a little hole in there. You get it inside the hole. And then you kind of like push, push it back this like so. Kind of going like up, I believe, like that. And then I just wiggle it out. And then I take it out like so. And then, yeah, it gets wider. I wish I showed you guys when I was doing it. I don't have to do that anymore. And I would show you guys, but I don't want to turn it again because like this thing isn't already big enough as it is. Um, yeah, so I just, I'm, I'm sorry guys, but yeah, that's what the key looks like for all of you so who I'm no longer turning my expander, and I'm happy about that, because I was just kind of getting alert, but a little worried as to how big this thing was actually going to end up getting, and it looks like this tooth right here, and it looks like it could just fall right off, but I don't think that's going to happen. Yeah. Anyway, so um, pain-wise, I am not in any pain. Throughout actually this whole start surgery, I was in very minimum amount of pain. I was in a whole lot of discomfort. Discomfort meaning that it was just so uncomfortable. It's like your body is just not used to it. You're just like, oh, what is going on up here? And the tightness was the thing that just honestly killed me. It just, oh, I was so frustrated with the tightness. It just made me feel so uncomfortable. But I just, you just can't be all, ugh, you know, you just kind of have to deal with it, suck it up, and, you know, everything will slowly come along, and 
so I'm still tight around here like I said in, in my earlier videos very tight around here or not here just up here and this is as far as I can smile I do notice though that when since I've gotten the start surgery done that I have fuller cheek bones now which is weird I don't know um I look different from the side I find but when I smile I can just definitely tell what my smile is so much more wider than it was before than it ever was before this is my smile um but all in all I am very happy with the results I am I feel good I feel very good actually um there's not a whole lot of things I can complain about right now. Um, I'm going to leave it as that, guys. Um, I don't really have a whole lot left else to say, but I am feeling great. I am feeling awesome. Two thumbs up. Um, yeah, so if you guys like my videos and you find my videos and somewhat helpful to you, Please like this video and please subscribe to my channel. I would greatly appreciate it. I am going to be posting pretty much every Tuesday on this whole journey. Um, I hope you guys stick around and you know watch my videos. I also plan on doing a family channel as well, which will be called um, Family North of 60. So once I get that set up, I'm going to probably start posting and sharing the link below in my Miss Diaz 1000 um, channel. Anyways, I hope you guys all have a wonderful and a fantastic day and a fantastic week ahead of you. Um, stay positive, um, you know, be happy and don't let the little things get in your way and 